Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how you can uh, extract BIOS files, for example, with just the device portal here. Uh, first, you, what you want to do is con connect to your IP, which you can find on the main screen of dev, uh, the dev menu. It'll give you an, a local IP. Put it here. If it doesn't work, put in HTTPS. That always seems to work here. And then once you're connected, um, go to File Explorer. Go to Local App Data. Now it doesn't have to be BIOS, but it's just an example. Anything that you put here will automatically extract zip files, and I never knew this. So I'm going to go to RetroArch here. I'm going to go to Local State and go to System. Now normally you'd go to Choose File, you know, pick one BIOS, upload, choose another one, upload. But all you have to do is choose File. I'm in my BIOS directory already because I did this as a test. I'm going to go down to my BIOS RetroArch. It doesn't ha have to be the exact same name. It just has to be in a zip. Then you just hit OK. OK. And then hit Upload. And it'll say Extract Zip File Contents to this directory. Put OK. And there you go. It didn't upload the zip file. It extracted it. So that way you don't even have to, you know, if... Um, FTP isn't working because it's empty or something. Just do that for a uh, zip file. Now, if you have a major zip file and you hit upload and it doesn't do anything, give it some time because there is no um, progress bar here. There never was. So just give it some time and it'll finish. And uh, I hope this helps because... Uh, you know, the FTP has always been broken. Whenever you FTP, it's empty. You can't really do anything. Um, this is one way, at least, to uh, get your BIOS and get to your save files and everything else this way. So, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.